Hi, Prosperity Team. This is Dr. Money coming to you from the Prosperity Corner of the Universe where silliness is sacred and nobody's perfect. I am your P.O.P., your Professor of Prosperity, and I'm here, why? So that all of our lives can pop with prosperity. Do you remember when we only considered one bottom line, and that was the bottom line is always money? And somebody thought, well, that's not really true. We need to to go for more than just money. We The bottom line needs to be profit, which is money, and planet. And so we developed somewhat of a, a double bottom line. And then someone said, well, we need to think about more than that, we need to think about profit, planet, and people because we want um, the we want people to have a chance as well. And then somebody said, well, you know, there's one more thing and that is purpose. When we're thinking about profit and making money, we want people to feel connected to this. So th we want people to be able to live their purpose and earn a living while they're living their purpose. And so this is an affirmation from my book, Words Make a Difference. And the affirmation is, I respect the quadruple bottom line in my business. And that's people, planet, profit, and purpose. I respect the quadruple bottom line in my business, purpose, people, profit, and, pl and the planet all matter equally all matter equally. Isn't that great? People, profit, purpose, planet, all matter equally. Because if something in that equation goes off wrong, what we end up doing is that we have potential collapse, we have greed, we have power, we have inequity. And so if we keep those thoughts in our mind when we think about bringing money into our lives, then we bring money into our lives with a sense of honesty and integrity. I love those ideas. Let's take a deep breath and breathe in. And as we breathe in, we breathe in our good. It's all around us, it's innocent, it's through us. And as we exhale, we exhale our intention that all other beings receive their good as well. Because in our intentions, we move from the story of me to the story of we. We want everyone to experience their good. I mean, it would be kind of crummy just to be an experience in our good, and then everybody around us is suffering. They're starving, or they're lack, or they're just all kinds of bad situations. So we want everyone to be uplifted at once. And one more thing, and that is that I love you. And I'm hoping you're loving me too. <laughs>